What's up, Barry? Dude, it's like a playground. Oh. We are right here in Detroit, Michigan at Detroit Diesel. And we're gonna show you guys how manufacturing is done on a huge level right here in the great Detroit area. Boom. Three point two million square feet of manufacturing floor space, man, and it is going off. Machining on the highest level right here. We got some crazy machines here to show you. Gantries, Hellers, all of it. Real machines, real machinists that have worked here for 10, 20, 30, 40 years. This is manufacturing US, baby. Let's go. This is insane. For those people that say we can't manufacture our own products right here in the US, this is living proof that that's not true. These guys put a million of these engines through this one line alone. How many Heller machines do you guys have on this floor? There's 45 CNC's from load till we get to the sequential machines, which is uh, the last two machines. So there's roughly uh, just under 50 CNC machines here. The majority yes. is Heller. All of them are Heller except two. about Detroit Diesel is like the heritage. This company has been here for 80 years, 3.2 million square feet of facility. And uh, you got machinists here. You got young ones, you got old ones. You have different generations, father and sons working together, daughters working together. Like some of these guys have been here 30 years and their dads worked here before that. So cool. Yeah, I've been working here 15 years. My father worked here. One thing unique about Detroit Diesel is that we're one family. We've worked here generation after generation. We're really proud of what we make here. We do a lot of machining. Uh, we machine the block, the cylinder head. We machine conrod, bearing caps, the liners that go into the blocks. We also do the assembly of the HDEP engine. We do the assembly of transmissions. We do axle assembly. So a lot of product under this facility that we're real proud to say we're built here in Detroit. When you actually look at the roof over there, when they brought in the Hellers and they raised that roof, the entire roof is as big as a football field. So think about that. The roof is as big as a football field. They had to cut it and then they had to lift it. And they did the entire lift within two days. Crazy engineering. We had to raise the roof 12 feet at the time. Our facilities group set up the procedure and the process. And what they did is they've taken these boots or a jacket on the column. And each, each column had a servo or a hydraulic setup on it that was synchronized. So when we raised the roof, each column was raised up per slot. Everything was checked. Confirmation was being done, a lot of communication and we raised the roof 12 feet. We've had multiple generations of engines built here in Detroit. Our bread and butter for a lot of years was the Series 60 engine. From there, we recognized we needed to evolve and develop with the technology, and that's where the H-Step platform came on board around 2006. We started the H-Step block line in partnership with Heller. From there, we've done further investments uh, with the machinery. You know, we've been running over 15 years. We've done rebuilds on these machines. Every year for the last five years, we take machines on site, shut them down, and we rebuild them from the bottom up. We're targeting over 80,000 blocks are gonna be machined on this line alone. So the machines have been running since 2006. You can see the robots up here grabbing the engines, putting them into the machine, taking them out of the machine, and they run nonstop. 
Now, since 2006, all these machines have been running. But then when it comes time to actually kind of refurbish a machine, Heller actually comes into this facility and they'll take a machine like this, they'll strip it down and rebuild it within one month. Like on this floor, they have a brand new machine and then it just continues to run. There's no taking them out, taking them in. It's like, boom, it happens on the floor. They get production back running. They got Heller on this side. H8000 right there. Heller's on that row. Heller's on this row. Heller, Heller, Heller. John, what's up, brother? What's going on, Tony? Hey, man. Happy to have you here. Woo, I, I do. Thank you, man. Like, I love being in here. A lot of big companies, they don't open their doors to the public, and this is one of the first times that Detroit Diesel has ever done anything like this, right? It absolutely has. This is one of the few times that they've really opened up the doors to somebody like, awesome. like this. It's fantastic, and it's a testament. Yeah, thank you, Detroit Diesel. Thank you, Detroit Diesel. And to Diesel. All, you, all you big companies out there trying to protect your intellectual property, and yeah, on the weekends, you're talking about people not getting in the trades. Our kids don't know manufacturing. People don't think that we build things in the U.S. anymore. Like, look at Detroit Diesel allowing us in. We need to open our doors. We need to show the world that manufacturing is king and that America is here because it was founded on the principles and founded on manufacturing. And it, without a strong manufacturing base, you have nothing. One of the things that makes Heller really unique is our processing knowledge. When it comes to processing components and finding the very best solution possible, that's where Heller really excels. And it really starts at the machines themselves. The machines are rock solid. Cast iron bases, cast iron columns, heavy, heavy depths of cut, removal rates that are incredibly high. And we look at these manufacturing facilities where they can't have machines down. They can't have machines that are always breaking. These machines, they need to run day in, day out, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 365 days a year. And that's really why Detroit Diesel chose Heller, because we are that company that can meet that criteria. And we've been doing it now for 20 years. Really, because of the, the success of this platform and this entire process has allowed Heller to bring this same process knowledge to many other customers today and clients that we continue to partner with. We just don't provide a CNC. We provide a solution that includes an entire process. And 20 years later, here we are, still here at Detroit Diesel, supporting our customers with outstanding service, with readily available spare parts. And we also understand that maybe the process or, or the solution that we proposed in 2006 isn't gonna meet today's challenge. And that's why we're always gonna be here to partner with our companies and our clients on solving the challenges of tomorrow. We always say that there, there are people that are not built to be doctor, bankers, and lawyers and be in the, the so-called like service industry. There are people that are born to make things. And if you take away their opportunities to make things, that's when like they run into problems and stuff. So thank God that you grew up in a manufacturing state. Absolutely. And Very then you fell in with Heller. Yep. Very and uh, you just walked the ranks with Heller. Like what yeah. an awesome career. You said you used to be in here working on these machines, yep. and now you help manage all of it, huh? Absolutely, and it, you know I love it because uh, I started out on the ground floor, worked my way up, and I think that gives you a great appreciation for the people that build all of this, yep. right? If you talk about machinists, if you talk about CNC, people that build CNCs here, yep. there are so few companies that manufacture CNC's here yeah. and Heller's one of them and the skill set involved in that yeah. is just I consider myself incredibly fortunate to have learned from and worked with some of these individuals that have just been really great and, and have really provided me a ton of knowledge That's that has awesome. helped me in my career. Woo! Detroit baby! That's it! This place is awesome. One million engines 
All of these machines are running since 2006. That is crazy production. You know, that's the problem. People talk about manufacturing. You go to malls, you go to places, I always say it, and they don't know. People don't know. The general public does not know that we make things here in America. But thanks to Detroit Diesel opening their doors to us, it's the first time they've ever done anything like this. They opened their doors for us to bring our cameras so we can show you high-end CNC machining happening in the real world right here in Detroit, Michigan. One million engines, like one million. And all of these hellers, all of these hellers just going off. All of them running. Manufacturing, baby. Yes! Oh, yes! This is sick.